Good day, good friends. Bobo C. Type Beers here with Black White Martyr Proc. I like this hand just fine. I It doesn't have removal, but it does have any fair deck. We have ways to stall, and then Marsh Flats and Field of Ruin give us a lot of mana quickly. So we'll be able to cast everything in our deck pretty soon unless this gets disrupted. And we still have Field of Ruin to lean on. If this is Tron, we have... Yeah, I, I like this hand. Noble Hierarch for our opponent. So the unfortunate thing here is this could be a Devoted Druid deck, and then we need the removal we don't have. Could also just be a Zoo deck, and then, you know, we have Kami, we have stuff to stall until we get to a, a Wrath spell. So I'm going to throw the Kami out and just to, ha just to see if they path it or something. I don't know why they would, but they could. You don't know them. Stop pretending like you know them. Ink Moth Nexus. So this is Infect. So the hand's a little better now. Because we have the Field of Ruin to kill their Ink Moth Nexus. We have Kami in case they, they go off. I would love to draw a path here, though. Especially as they're attacking with their dork. Yeah, they're attacking with their dork. And if I remember correctly, Infect doesn't run a ton of basics, so... The Crucible with Field of Ruins seems like it could be really brutal here. Marsh Flats for us, drawing a lot of lands when we don't really need them. Let's see if they tap to protect it. Looks like they might. Which does hurt us because then we don't get Ink Moth Nexus. But it makes them burn a removal spell. Uh, we don't get the land, but we do have another Field of Rune. So it turns out we did kind of need it. I'm going to attack with Kami here. Free damage is free damage. Noble plays another Noble. Another Ink Moth Nexus. Unfortunate, but as long as we can get that Crucible down, we're in good shape. They do activate their Ink Moth Nexus. Show me that you can kill me. So I'll crack my cut and then I'll crack my Kami. But if they just kind of do cheap damage, then I won't worry. Scale up. Okay. So that would come in for eight. Hmm. Three cards left in hand. Yeah, I'll sack. If we get an Ors off Charm, we can just get that right back.
Sorin also gets it back. And they don't have access to mana, so we will get to kill one of these Ink Moth Nexuses. Nexi? Nuxus? No, I, I think it would be Nexi? Or Nexosis? Depends on any X. I don't know that root, unfortunately. <laughs> I don't think it really matters. Um, let's play a Sarah. What do we got? Activating Moth Nexus. Three cards in hand. Can they pump their way to lethal here? They draw a card. So they can't pump their way to lethal yet, it would, it would appear. They can get up to three, though. So next turn, I think I cast the Sorin to go get Kami and make them kill something that's not me, if they don't want me to do that every turn. And then I worry about getting Crucible down. They seem to be debating, doing some math to see if they can go for it here. Groundswell. They did get a land. So we're down to seven. And Glistener Elf. So we absolutely now need the Kami here. And we will use our life total judiciously here. Um, I don't much care about taking two to, to, to have a godless shrine. They're tapped out, so they can't stop me from getting this Kami at least once. And then they have to kill Soren. Actually, they can't kill Soren because I just keep getting back Kami. Yeah, that's how that works. They have to kill Kami before they can kill Sorn. For a while, I was not using Kami in this deck. Um, and I think situations like this prove why Kami with Sorn is so useful. It's just going to let me stall so well. And kind of steal a game I have... Potentially steal game I have no business being involved in. They activate Ink Moth Nexus. The only sad part about it is they can't they don't have to pump to kill Soren because of the Exalted triggers. So they don't waste mana here. Or they don't use mana here, I should say. Orzhov Charm allows us to get Kami back another time after Soren is dead. I'm going to get back Marsh Flats. Since I can't ink, uh, attack the Ink Moth Nexus anyways, I will not attack this time. And with Marsh Flats, if I need it to use Orzhov Charm in a pinch, I could.
And now I'll go get Misfail Planes. There's actually a very good chance I'll have Amiria active before they can do anything. Um, so let's Field of Ruin, see if they have a way to protect that Ink Moth Nexus. It looks like they do. So we will be unable to, to get a land off of that, unfortunately. Vines of Vastwood. They don't have to kick it to make it unable to be the target of spells or abilities. Bummer for us, unfortunately. Um, and we will leave up Kami here. Um, actually, let's go get Ranger. Let's use Ranger VS to go get Walking Ballista, I think. Yeah. And that allows us to sh to shoot their one ones in response to stuff. They're tapped out, so no reason to not attack with with Sarah here. We will happily trade our one one for their one one if that's what they so choose, or if they want to burn a pump spell to get it, that's fine with me. And it looks like they might do that. Fine with me. Yeah, I have no problem with them wasting pump spells. I think this time I'm not even going to risk the Field of Ruin getting quote-unquote countered, getting like stifled, for lack of a better term, because I'm at the point now where I can Amir you back Kami every turn. So I think Marsh Flats is just a better get here. We will pay two life here, so we can make Ballista 3-3. Three, three. I'm actually just going to make it a 2-2. I want to leave up Ors off Charm. Just in case. No reason to risk it if there's no reason to risk it, you know? I doubt they have main deck removal, but if they do, I'm going to regret not leaving that up. Let's see if they have a way to pump it. And then I shoot, shoot it again with Ballista. Make them waste two pump spells here. And now we'll have Amiria active, plus Orzhov Charm. Giver of Runes is fine. I'm not happy about it, but it is what it is. 
we get another Orzov charm. So we'll go get Marsh Flats. And I'll start putting stuff back as well. I want to put that Soren back. To make them think they have it. Yeah, I'm just going to put Sorens and Orders Off Charms and stuff like that back and then eventually use Ranger Cap to to get back stuff. Little grindy and anno obnoxious way to do this, but it is what it is. Let's go get the other Misfail planes. I like ra having Ranger. And that allows us to actually start trying to kill them here. Sorry if that car alarm is coming in through my microphone. A lot of people in my neighborhood have this weird habit of not unlocking their door and just yanking their door open and setting off the car alarm. We're just, we now have Amiria Loop established. So let's see if they respond to that or how they plan to respond to that. We can now start trying to use Field of Ruin aggressively to kill their Ink Moth Nexi. Because it doesn't matter if we lose the land. Attack with a ground troop, which means we might not have to... Oh, they give it protection. Okay. I was like, oh, we can block that. I could ki have killed that with my Orzov charm, but like I said, I don't want to risk it. And I want to have at least one of those lying around in case they find a way to kill Kami on their turn. I don't think they have it. Like I said, I, I 
feel like there's no way they actually have that, but I don't think it's worth risking. And let's start putting some more Zolf Charms back to make that happen faster. We do have to be careful to not mess around too much with our clock, though. And they concede to that. Yeah, we had the lock pretty well established at that point. Very, very, very thankful for Kami being in the deck there. Let's bring in Sorcerer Spyglass. Uh, Campbell doesn't make a lot of sense. Hex Parasite doesn't make a lot of sense. Disenchant, eh, not huge on Disenchant. It would kill an Ink Moth Nexus, but they would have to activate it, and I don't like casting my removal on their uh, their steps. So. I think, let's cut a big ranger and let's cut, I guess, Weathered Wayfarer, just because they're so light on lands. I want to keep Soren in. We saw there how useful Soren can be to, to keep generating blockers and such. So we don't have a ton of sideboard for them, unfortunately. This, um, I, I don't want to not, I like that I can get just, it does have the Kami lock, but it's a little slow and I need a removal spell or two in the meantime. Wow. Um, oof, yeah, no, I can't, I can't do that. Yeah, that, that'll play, that'll play for sure. Uh, so let's keep, let's put back a Martyr and a Heliod. We do need to draw a white mana source. Our opponent starts with Noble Hierarch. We draw another path, which is very nice. Again, we need, a, we need white mana. Ickerclaw Murr. Let's see if they protect that. They do not. Which is fine. I do like that Ghost Quarter. I'm going to play Ghost Quarter here. I would love to keep them off of Infectors. That would be fantastic. If they, if they only kept a hand with one Infector, that's very good for us. Rest in peace is a problem. So maybe we should have brought in the disenchants. Especially when we draw Orzhov Charm, rest in peace becomes an even bigger problem. Luckily, Orzhov Charm is still a removal spell. Kind of should have expected Rest in Peace, if I'm being honest. But they cannot draw an Infector, and are just going to slowly try to whittle us away with a Noble Hierarch.
There's an infector. Let's see if they can protect it through double removal. Works for me. One less pump spell in their deck. And we finally get that white mana source we need. Iker I draw Martyr here. So what I will do is play Ranger. Probably helps if I tap better. I'm going to play Ranger and get Ballista. Um, Ballista gives me two cracks at killing their infector. Unfortunately, I can't cast anything else. So casting Kami there would it would have been a waste. If they can give Ikerclaw Mer Trample, we're in trouble. Let's see. if they have a way to give it trample. It does not appear that they had a way to give it trample, which works for us. Cavern will name human here. And I'm gonna throw down the martyr and the ballista. They have a ton of mana is my only my only beef. So if we go for killing it here and they can pump twice. Well, yeah, no, that's fine. I would much rather them pump on their turn and lose their pump spells, which they do. The only issue here is now I'm out of creatures. <laughs> so we're kind of dead to rights. They can just get in after five turns of swinging in with an Iker Clumber. Because <laughs> of Exalted. Three cards left in hand for our opponent. And they just kill our martyr. Yep. Big sad. We could be dead here. I'm gonna leave Ghost Quarter up. Show me the Carfax. Scale up. They just need one more pump spell. And they have it. So, good on them. So, let's... Bring in the disenchants, I suppose. And we'll take out Cleansing Nova. Maybe? Hmm. I guess we'll just take out the Heliod. 
Like, I'm using Walking Ballista as removal here. I don't know if I, I need the Heliod combo. I'd rather have access to everything else in the deck. It's going to be a tough game three. Infect is always a really fun matchup. It it always seems really one-sided. It's rare that the games are grindy. Like, that was more grindy than Infect ever really gets. But it's always a very edge-of-the-seat kind of matchup, for me at least. So I'm really, really, really happy to get to play against it. Even though it means possibly losing. It's possible that the Wraths aren't very good here. Like, they do get somebody... They do kill the creature if if they can't... Um, if I can get to them, but they really just kill one, two creatures. And in situations where I haven't answered Ink Moth Nexus, there are times where they just keep an, in, an Ink Moth Nexus alive and kill me that way. A lot of different ways this could go. All right, let's see what we have here. Hmm. So we have Ranger Cap to get Kami. We have Disenchants and Orzhov Charm. It's tough. I think I'm going to go to six. I think... Hmm. Yeah, this one's really hard. There's just no guarantee I get the black mana to to cast doors off charm, so I think I need something a little more, a little safer, and doesn't get much better here. Um, hmm. I guess I can't particularly afford to go down much further, if I'm being honest. And you know, there's a chance there's a fetch land just sitting on top. I don't feel good about this, though. We need to draw really, really well for this to work, and our opponent kept a full seven, so. Yeah, they get it. They get their Glistener off right away. We get another Orzhov Charm. Let's see it. Let's see if they can just turn to us here. Or if they even try. They don't scale up, which is a good sign. Yeah, we'll take one poison counter. Oof. Double oof. What that means is that they don't have much removal, though. Or much pump. Okay. This, this we can possibly do. Because now we ghost quarter the other... P no! That wasn't what I meant to do, but it doesn't really matter, I suppose. Gotta kill that giver of runes, I feel like. Four cards in hand, We're, we could still just be dead. Uh, 
Let's see it. No pumps yet. They just play another giver here. Acroclaw Murr for our opponent. And a Razor Verge Thicket. Okay. I'm okay with the path. Path works for me. Would have really liked to have... Let's see. So, three comes in, we're at six. Horizon Canopy for our opponent. Let's see if they crack it right away. Rest in peace. Yeah, that seems about right. Two cards left in hand for our opponent. Let's try the path here. I'm actually going to... Let's path the... Yeah, let's path the Mur. See if they pump. They do not pump. That's a good sign. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can just destroy all the stuff. They have a card draw spell, though, so... Draw a land here, please. Draw land land. Please go land land. Four cards in hand, all that man. I can't imagine we, we win this one. Ink Moth Nexus for our opponent. It, it is a land. Giver Runes for our opponent. Back to two cards in hand. And lethal. Close. Oof. Well, yeah, I think we're just dead. We seem pretty dead. Yeah, not really anything we can do. GG's. Uh, great game there, great game there. I will see you in the next one.